Hey, what's up? It's your girl, DJ Sky High Baby, and you are watching Great Tea News. They love to be seen. This is Krishan in church. All right. Krishan in church. I think it's when she first had Junior. All right. This is crazy, y'all. Uh, Krishan then turned into uh, Mother Teresa. This is Mother Teresa Rock. Mother Teresa Rock. Okay. And you know why? You know why I want to show you all of this, y'all? What? Why this is so funny with all of the church stuff and all of the God's plan and all this stuff? Let's talk about this. Let's talk about the real meat and potatoes of why y'all really here. Because I find it's very funny. Was it God's plan for Krishan to miss court today? Was it uh was it God's plan to miss court today? Is that very godly? Aren't you supposed to face your uh trials and tribulations head on and overcome them? I don't know. Shout out to uh Corey Lombardi for the tea. He says, Well, I'll be damned. While Krishan is out recording her new show on the Zeus app, right? Her appearance for today's sanction hearing for her second lawsuit wasn't a priority of hers. The crazy part is that they had the hearing on Zoom. So it's not an excuse of it being in California and she's not able to uh, attend it because she's in Oklahoma. The hearing was on Zoom. He says everyone was a, uh, was a, a, in attendance, but Krishan. And this is the lawsuit that's uh, um, with uh, James Chanel Wright, y'all. I thought she, I thought she was trying to get everything in order. I thought she was getting all her ducks in order, y'all. I don't know. I, I thought she was just this innocent person, and you know, got her all. You know, what I'm saying like. I don't know. Like, I don't. Is, is this God's plan? I, I'm, I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding why she didn't go to court, especially if it's via Zoom. She could have did this on her damn phone. You could have did a little 10, 20 minute little break while you recording God's plan and go to your damn court uh, here. You know, sit in the car. You sat in the car and got a new tooth. You can't sit in the car real quick and attend your uh your, your court hearing. Yeah, she go she she go uh, automatically owe this man money with a default judgment. He says the same thing happened with her hearing for James Chanel Wright lawsuit last week. Oh, I think this is the one for uh Rama, y'all. She missed the one for Rama tonight today. Um, she was a no show, so she was a no show for James Chanel Wright, and I guess this is the one for Rama because she did have two uh court dates to, uh this this month before her uh probation hearing. Okay. Uh, he said, yeah, she was a no show shaking my head. The sanction for the lawsuit have been continued until December 30th, 2024. Remember, Rama is suing Krishan for over thirty five thousand dollars. And she filed a, a, a sanction due to Krishan's failure to cooperate with the lawsuit. She was served in Cali jail. She knew about today's hearing. Wow. So it's not like this was out of nowhere either, y'all. All right. So this was God's plan. God's plan was for you to, to, to miss court. Wow. Yeah, this is the one that she uh got against Rama, I believe. So she already missed the one with James Chanel Wright a couple weeks ago, right? Or last week or whatever. And then this is the one with Rama. It says schedule a remote appearance. You can schedule a remote appearance for your case by uh selecting a uh, case litigation uh area below. The court will accept reservations within 14 days from the current day and up to 30 minutes prior to the hearing start time. So, yeah, so she knew way ahead of time. She just didn't go. She just didn't go. Wow. Yeah, they filed a sanction. So her next court date is uh, December 30th when it comes to uh, Rama, y'all. Wow. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's the face you got to give. God's plan, all right, right? This, this is, this is hilarious, y'all. I'm laughing. October 12, 2015. Yes. Okay. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way for you, uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. <laughs> You are a goofy no, bitch. No, that's not true. And these same people will ignore all of this that we're talking about, y'all. This is paperwork. This is proof. Somehow we're still haters. This and that. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, what the hell? Are you not reading? Are you not seeing what we seeing? Like, they just ignore all of this, y'all. They ignore all of this. It's weird. It's weird. And remember, these are people that's old enough to be my grandma. Not my mom. My grandma. It wouldn't be my mom, my grandma. And I'm like, y'all, y'all been on this earth way too long to be this weird and slow. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, y'all didn't have the power to vote for four decades. Four, five decades. Y'all was voting when uh, Nixon was in office and JFK. You know what I'm saying? And Bill Clinton and all that stuff. Ronald Reagan. There's no way y'all, y'all just this enamored with Krishan Rock like it's weird to where as though when we bring up the actual proof y'all just ignore everything and just call us a hater it's weird it's like and then y'all claim that y'all Christians and godly and she don't represent nothing godly you know they ignore all of this y'all they ignore all of this so when they come around this is what we say you keep talking man and you shut the fuck up Huh? Right. Just say what we want. Oh, uh, shut up. When you think about fuck it. Up. It's crazy, y'all. But it doesn't stop there. Okay? Shout out to Corey. Krishan has court Friday, y'all. Just, just a couple of days. She is gonna uh face her consequences. Now, it's gonna be very interesting to see if she get a slap on the wrist, though. She's supposedly facing eight years. I don't think she's going to do that. Um, but she got a lot of probation violations, y'all. She has a lot of violations. So for her to just get a short amount of time, is it, it, it gives you the side eye. It makes you give the side eye, okay? So shout out to Corey. He says, after uh, tomorrow, Shawty... Krishan will be facing her fate two days later. Here's what to expect. The green highlight shows the process she uh, went through when she had to get uh, arrested, extradited, and then was able to bond out. The judge ordered her hearing 20 days later, which her 20 days is this Friday, September 27, 2024, which is typical in cases similar to her offense. Now in the yellow highlight, it shows what she's facing the da can produce evidence and changes wait in charges from her other offenses she caught all while on probation in oklahoma so the, basically they can use her beating up um beating up james chanel Wright um against her and remember she went to jail for that she had to do time for that so they can use that against her uh this can make it much easier for the da to send her uh, straight back to jail or prison so let's read the green and the yellow for you the green says once the defendant is arrested he or she will appear for an arraignment uh, of the application to revoke the defendant can typically bond on an application to revoke uh, a hearing will be set on the application to revoke within 20 days the yellow says the hearing is uh an uh evidentiary hearing but the rules of evidence and the procedural protections are different from when the defendant was originally charged. In short, it is much easier for the district attorney to send a defendant to jail or prison on the application to revoke than on the original charges. Wow. It's not looking good reading that. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. A hearing within 20 days, state waves, hearing within 20 days, re, uh, revocation, hearing, we already know that. 
Yeah. Yeah. So they're going to use this against her. And remember, she has multiple violations. Okay. She was on the run. She didn't do the uh, community service. She wasn't supposed to leave the state of California, which she did. She literally attacked a whole nother person. Okay. And went to jail for that. Okay. She went on the, uh, she went online and literally said, Hey, I'm not turning myself in. He was talking trash about the judge and the DA. Okay. Online. And then remember they use this against you. Y'all when you don't, um, turn yourself in, they use that against you. If they have to spend their money to come get you. All right. So the extradite and all that stuff. So it is it, very, yeah, it de it's definitely intentional. It was definitely intentional. Okay. So, uh, this weekend is going to be a time y'all. We're going to have a lot to talk about. We're going to have a lot to talk about. So they're filming daddy's Mail West right now. They're filming God's plan. Charlotte's in a uh, rehab. Okay. Uh, Christian and turned into mother Teresa. Okay. And, um, she has court Friday for the probation hearing and she is facing possible prison time. Okay. So, uh, it's going to be very interesting and y'all know, I'm gonna keep y'all updated. Y'all y'all. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Um, I I'm very interested, but as of now, of all of the, um, evidence that we've seen. All right. And that's been shown paperwork. We covered it plenty of times. Okay. Um, she need to pay her uh, debt to society, okay? Especially for what she did to Junior. I don't care what nobody said. You ain't gonna under understand everything. And everything ain't meant for you to understand. A house full of women, cuz. House full of sensitive ass females dealing with they damn hormones. Y'all some unstable creatures. See, I ain't gonna say the B word. I'm gonna say unstable creatures. It's my new word. Like, I don't know how to find my audience, bro. Who is, who is your audience? <laughs> Speak black, toxic bottom feeders. You, you a hater. <laughs> About the snag tooth bitch. What's snag tooth bitch? That bitch, Krishan. Um, oh, he don't. So, let me say, oh, he doesn't like Krishan. I said, no. So, this big 40 odd number ass woman has the nerve to go in her fucking front room and turn on it's a fucking vibe all the time. I look at that bitch. And look at my home girl. I don't know, man, if you don't get me out this motherfucking broad house, talking about a fucking vibe all the time. This bitch here damn near 50. I see what. Like Rick T say, unstable creatures. It's a damn shame.